Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, I am Ricky. This is Chelsea. <laughs> Together we are Rixy Vlogs. It's been two weeks since we last uploaded and everybody's acting like we fucking gave up. We ain't been nowhere. We've been posting TikToks, Instagram stories, Instagram pictures. We've been active everywhere, but here for the simple fact that I think y'all forgot I got my wisdom teeth taken out. I need to recover. We've lost a couple subscribers because we didn't post for two weeks. It's all right, they'll come back. Just a quick update on Sosa. He is three and a half months. Mm -hmm. We don't know his weight. We're getting a scale later today. He's chilling. He's um, a quick learner. Definitely a smart guy. A handful of uh, personality and like hell no. We're gonna start out the day and we're gonna head to the gym. Sorry if you guys were missing out on two weeks of us not uploading, but it's definitely good to hear that you wanna see stuff. Just leave some ideas, please, because we definitely need them. Making our way up in the world, slowly. But surely. Making a name for ourselves. Oh, but we're working on it. It's, you gotta trust the process and we have been trusting this process for quite some time. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you for clicking on this video. Hopefully you enjoy the vlog. Shake, 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 shake. Get out of the background. Did I come up? Yes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's enough. <laughs> okay, Ricky. <laughs> Okay! I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Damn! I like these rice cakes, they're Quaker. I use the chocolate. <laughs> she starts to sell in chocolate! <laughs> the chocolate ones because they're a little tastier. I have an audience. Me. <laughs> it's 100% whole grain and gluten free, so I guess that's good. We definitely don't count our calories, but we do watch what we eat during the week. Monday through Friday. Saturday, Sunday. Ooh. It's so weird. When I put peanut butter on them, this is a like crunchy peanut butter. Calories, doesn't matter. So I'm gonna use this banana. How many calories? Uh, I'm just gonna slice it and put banana slices in. We either do this or we do Rice Krispies. And then the remains go to the guys. Hey, everybody. Sit. Give him the banana. Push. Come here, Sosa. Sit. Up. Ah, relax. Paul. There you go. The reason why they're separated for right now is because we're gonna head out soon and together it's a no-go. These guys don't realize how big they are compared to him and it leads to some chaos sometimes. But he does say in his playpen though, he's yeah. not like free. <laughs> Let's see what the chef got. Oh wow, look at this. Wow, wow a reminder fellas. What's that face? <laughs> What's the reminder? The reminder is to get your shorty a vase and make sure it's full. This is the final product. We are gonna get into that. Oh, tell them what the hell this guy is so we don't have to do it in, in oh. the minute of the copper drop. Just <coughs> do a, a montage of what I speak. Oh? Him. A montage? <laughs> yeah, like just go. Oh. Him. So Sosa is a French bulldog. <laughs> he is a pied face Frenchie. As you can see, his face has two patches around his eyes. He is mostly white. He has like little, a little. <laughs> he doesn't let me go. A little brown spot on his booty. Yeah. He's so cute. Yeah, just an update on him because we didn't give any info. We just kind of went to Mexico and bought him. <laughs> this is the new member. We didn't formally introduce him and we will pop up his character now to the addition to the banner now. Yeah, he's a ball of energy. Or how did both your sides of the family react? Because every time we get a dog, everybody's like, oh my God. Do we need another dog? That's what the question was. Yeah. The answer is yes. It's always, <laughs> it's always gonna be yes. I wanna have a lot of dogs. I think dogs make, at least me, I don't know about you. Dogs make me happy. When they're not. I know, but well, obviously we don't have like the space to, but he's little. Yes. But eventually, yes, yes, yes. Eventually we'll have big land and they'll all be free and happy and back to their original ways of living. Except for, uh, except for him. <laughs> so, so grateful. Cop or drop. We did film this prior and the file got corrupted for whatever reason. So that's gone. So we're here. Some shoes are no longer in our possession because they either got sold, traded, or just. So the first one, I'll go ahead and pop up either a boomerang or a picture here. Travis Scott, Black Phantom. Drop. Any thoughts? <laughs> I said drop, but I think it looks cuter, smaller, but the packaging was nice. Not the prettiest of shoe. Travis obviously has done a lot better of colorways. I do not like all black shoes. Drop for me. Next shoe was the Ama Manier 4. Super, super expensive. The retail price was about $265, which just kind of threw us off completely. Chelsea did like the shoe originally. Then we got it in hand. Did not like the materials. Did not like the color. And it just seemed super stiff. I didn't like it. 
Me there. The packaging was cool. I guess Jordan and all these brands are doing like the sliding box. I expected much better quality. And we do have a couple shoes in hand. We can start off with the one that was highly anticipated because every store was telling me we didn't get them. We didn't get them. And I'm like, how didn't you get them? And I told you guys it was gonna be the hardest one to get, but with the shoe game, patience is key. So here we go. Ba, 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 ba. A toddler pair of the Jordan 1 Lost and Found. Finally, obviously it's a cop. Chelsea has her pair. And now we're just all matching. They look cute a little, but the cracking is a little excessive on top one. Very exaggerated. <laughs> but this shoe has like been re-releasing every so often. It's just a matter of who you know, if you're in the right place at the right time, and all this haddock. Next pair of shoes, they had restocked on right around Christmas time on Kobe Mambasita website. I love this shoe in 2010 11 they redid it i was kind of excited then i saw it in hand the color's just off and i think everybody owns it at this point i'm fed up with it i think the concept was pretty cool i know he wanted them when they first came out but the colors are very vibrant from this shoe. too vibrant the comparison like hand in hand like it's a whole different color and i wish they would have just redid it the right way because i'm not a fan of this like i said everybody is now hooping in these you would not see me hooping in the kobe 6 grinch you will see me hooping in a kobe 6 Masita. Masita. drop drop last but definitely not least chelsea loves this guy she loves anything he makes and produces so you know this was her christmas gift comes with two laces that nobody really ever uses show tell them about that i didn't know that it's a Puerto Rican flag if you turn it sideways. This is supposedly the fifth and last collab they do on the forum. This was the only pair that really had me like, damn, I actually like this. The pictures definitely didn't do this justice because oh, it def white, it looked way too white. And in hand, they're super cream. Chelsea has been all about neutrals, creams, and all that. So, oh, what? How do you have it on the blue pair? What if I put the blue one right here? Nah. <laughs> it looks like that's it for sneakers right now. Nothing in the near future that looks like it's going to be something we were wanting a cop so we won't really touch base on that like i said just a lot of restocks incoming yeah nothing too too crazy jordan brand released their spring collection we like a couple shoes from that and we'll obviously show them once we do get them in hand but until then finish the workout it was a good workout definitely gonna feel it tomorrow she's over here getting recipes damn Justin, that's your fucking Oh my god, this is your seventh sample today. But you know what? They're never here. Don't even lie to me. That's just nasty. Oh my god. We've been prioritizing what we eat and what we put into our body. Health uh, is wealth. We're trying to live a little longer. That oat milk is so yummy. But for you, the ice cream maker, we can make acai bowls. Oh my god. Oat milk. Oh my god. And with the drizzle. Oh my god. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> We're done with groceries. A lot more that wasn't on the list that ended up on the list. It happens sometimes. Tell them about how it happens sometimes while I drive. Uh -huh. Yeah. yeah and today we plan on eating on a new restaurant which we haven't figured out yet but we just want to kind of like spice it up with the vlog so we're gonna find a restaurant that we haven't tried something new to us something new hopefully to you guys and go ahead and give it a try so we're showered we're changed we're ready to go out again we just made this tiktok i'll put it here I'm still what are your thoughts on it i can't believe that's how you look i can't believe that was a thing. Cringy as fuck. When I look back at pictures like that, I'm fucking so glad that we didn't vlog in times like that. I don't know who that person is. We're at Oak Brook now, have a couple of returns. I think the main thing we're here for is Lush. So we'll show you that right after Zara. Let's see what else we got here. Mm, nah, that's looking like an Ikea curtain. That's the one I have in there. Oh <laughs> shit, never mind. We are in line and have a handful to try on for the Mrs. Yang. We will see what she ends up with. Chelsea's trying on stuff. I'm waiting on here. You know, this is the life you choose. Being a freaking boyfriend, you gotta wait fucking ever. It has now been 20 minutes. I'm concerned. Shit for myself. God damn. Did some damage at Zara onto Lush. Hopefully they have what she wants. This place is expensive, but it smells so good. It smells so fucking good. All these bath bombs? And she won't even be taking baths. I'm gonna. Oh, okay. We are at Dick's Sporting Good here to look for a specific item. Chelsea is looking for this cup mug thing. They got it, they got it. If not, we're gonna go ahead and eat at Benny Hanna. First time. I'm excited because the last time we were supposed to go to Benny Hanna, we didn't. They ain't have it. What the hell, man? Bunch of Hydro Flask and Getty. Can I get this one? 
Right, you know what's crazy, guys? She has like fucking 20 different cups. <laughs> um, comment down below, guys. This one, right? All right. Okay. So Chelsea's gonna get a bottle. I'm getting some socks. Got the cup, got the socks. Time for Benny Hanna. Hopefully, we can get seated. And I can smell that shit from here. Hopefully, we get seated. Hopefully, it's good. Keep it posted. We got seated. Starting off with miso soup. And we have a salad, which I'm probably not gonna touch. <laughs> gonna get some shrimp. Got some zucchini. Now we got some chicken fried rice. We got some pollo. Chicken teriyaki. Have my filet mignon packed or to go box. So, guys, with this fat ass spoon, but it's alright, that's how she be taking the scoops anyway. And just like that, we out of here. Definitely an experience. What'd you think? That's good. Got a bag to go, I'm gonna head home. It's late as fuck, and then probably see you guys tomorrow for breakfast. We're giving the dogs their food this morning. They eat their kibble and blueberries, and I'm gonna put the frozen yogurt treat in there. And Sosa gets the same. Uh, Monday through Friday, we give them their kibble and the ground turkey. They eat better than me. You're about to have some delicious food. Can you believe this? Look at this. Spoiled ass dogs. This one there, and then place one there. Hey man, you got yours over here, come on. Right there. I don't know why you need your ice like this for two days, but. When you have iced coffee and it melts, your coffee tastes like water. Oh, like a, um, what do I drink that you can relate to? Like a, like a soda pop. Sure. Yeah, sure. Ghirardelli, Ghirardelli. You're gonna put that first? Yeah. Oh. This is not Starbucks. Mm. We're quite generous with the caramel. So Chelsea's gonna prep her coffee first. Yeah, so then I can drink this while I'm making grilled cheese sandwiches. Got the griddle back here. What are you doing now? We need this ground coffee. It's Starbucks, mm -hmm. caramel something. Then I put this here. Nice, how long does it take? Like three or four minutes. 34? Three or four minutes. Oh, this was a white elephant gift. Chelsea picked it, she got it stolen. You stole it back. I stole it, cause I'm a fucking thief. The point is, we got it here. This was actually really useful for her, so I stole it for her. Everything I do is for her. You know that, right? Yeah. You so once it's ready, I'm gonna add this non-dairy creamer, almond milk, and oat milk. So we have grilled cheese, Chelsea has a iced coffee, I have a smoothie. Oh yeah. We're gonna eat breakfast and then continue with the day. So I'm gonna be doing an Amazon haul. Hey! I'm gonna show everything I ordered today. So we're gonna try to make this a part of the videos going forward just because someone here does tend to order a lot. And now we have access to a bot that shows price errors, special discounts and all that. Thank you, Ines. Here's one of them. So one thing I ordered is this water pulse nasal like suction thingy. I don't know if you guys seen those videos on TikTok. So I get this like electric nail file type of thing, you know, in the salon when they no, file your nail down. It has like different drill bits where you can file stuff. It's cordless and it was just cheap. This was supposed to be a uh, 80 to $90 item and Chelsea got it for like 20 bucks. And I ordered it this morning and it came today. That is insane. <laughs> we don't question it once shit goes on sale, honestly, because... Whoa, the Zoom was cool. I do my own manicures. Sometimes pedicure, so this comes in handy when you take off the drill polish. It's uh, a stacking tray, a two-tier storage shelf. It stacks like this picture here. I bought this to put like my perfumes and stuff. These airtight cases I use for the box because they slide onto their collar. We used to have these, but then I wanted some fancier ones, so we got some to hang, and they lost their airtight. So. so much for that shit. Oh, so I got these miracle patch. Pimple patches because Mighty Patches are so expensive. Yep. And Aja tried these and she said they 
kind of like the same, so. Thanks, Ashra. 96 patches for like 15, 16. I also got these glass nail files. Also a price error. $3.86, and it was a yellow one. I will give it free. And they're supposed to be 30 bucks each. Crazy. I've never tried these glass nail files, but I was like, for three dollars, why not try it? Ooh, and it comes in a case, so just so you put it on the leash, you loop it. When you're walking the dogs, you know, so to say poop, and then you put the the poop bag in one of these X's, and you insert it there, so that way you're not like carrying it in your hand. But we have three dogs, so who wants to carry three poops? So I got these like spoons to like mix coffee and tea, but these are so. Bonk, but I guess whatever. They were two for five dollars. So I ordered this Levi's jacket. Um, it's originally a hundred dollars and got it for seventeen dollars. Crazy! <laughs> if y'all want the sauce, ten dollars a month. Let me know. Most of this stuff are spreaders. Yep. <laughs> so we got this thing that goes around the bar. It's like foam thing. Cause my neck be hurting. So uh, we want to take this to the gym with us. Yeah, cause they do have it there, but. Kind of gross. You can't, yeah, very gross. And last but not least, we finally got a digital scale. Ooh! Triple A batteries. Three, please. Can't see. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> That's fucked up. What the fuck you mean that's fucked Your up? Your reaction fucking mean. No, like, oh, <laughs> like that's what you wanted to be at. Uh huh. <laughs> She's gonna do some bullshit right now. Dude. Come out! <laughs> <laughs> that's everything I bought on Amazon. But why don't we sell so? We haven't weighed them since we brought them back from Mexico. Come here, big papa. 12.9. Holy shit! It's a scrub mommy special edition, it's a cat. So now that breakfast is done, I'm um, gonna go ahead and wash the dishes and then we're gonna give the guys a shower because they, yeah. they need it, they're a little stinky. So we're, I'm gonna get into the showering portion, Chelsea's gonna get into the drying and grooming portion. Don't start that shit. Why? Guys, if you haven't had black grapes, you are missing out. I fucking hate when she does that <laughs> shit. <laughs> Now what is this for? It uh, covers her ears and I guess it reduces the noise because it's pretty loud. Looking good, man. This is our Sunday. Pretty chill vibes. Dogs, football. What more can you ask for, huh? We are exhausted. All three are washed, clean, brushed. We're done for the weekend and we're just gonna call it a day. We're gonna shower up ourselves and just really chill. Any ideas you guys do have, please leave it in the bottom in the comments. We do have a couple things planned, so hopefully those things come into life and you will see. But until then, thank you for watching. See you next video.